says that light became, vegetations became, and so forth and so on. That's the same thing we're doing in this nation and that's why I'm confident and I'm saying I am the change that Nigeria is waiting for. And I know that at the end, a couple of minutes, you begin to say that confessions also. You are the change that Nigeria is looking for. Nigeria is waiting for, you are the change. And God's word is preparing you right now to really deliver and perform when it's your time as it's required of you. Oh, so beautiful. God placed in my heart and God gave me a vision recently. I saw an electronic substance, a rectangular shape, electronic substance. And the light was moving in that substance, kinetic movement, it sort of following the shape of that substance. And suddenly, I had the Spirit of God made me know that that is a countdown for change for the countries of Africa. That's a countdown for change specifically for the country of Nigeria. Brothers and sisters, this is not a time to play the games of a decision Christian. This is not a time to fold your hands and look at wicked men doing evil things. This is a time to act. This is a time to take your place. This is a time to begin to effect changes from your home, from your provision store, from, from your mechanic workshop, from your hospital, from your office, wherever you are, from your bank, wherever you are, from your counter, where you are, where you are, where, and your desk, wherever you are. It's a time to begin to effect changes from that. And knowing that God's word has placed you there, God's Spirit has placed you there to be an example of a citizen that have the nation at heart. It is not destined that the citizens of the great nation of Nigeria will begin to suffer and suffer and die suffering. No, God wants us to enjoy the goodness of all that He's created for us. And I tell you, brothers and sisters, let's go on this ride of change. God showed me that and said there's a countdown. And if the righteous do not rise up and take their place, they will let it go for wicked and unreasonable men. There's a countdown for change for every unrighteousness in Nigeria. There's a countdown for change for every unrighteousness in Africa. And God is giving the warning. God has put the word in my heart that everyone who's walking in an injustice, who's walking in oppression, of people and souls, so many things, God is giving you a word today that this is a time to change, that the cup is filled up and it's time to change. This is time for repentance and the clock is ticking for every corruption that is going on. The clock is ticking. God's word has come to you today. And it's preparing you as a change that Nigeria is waiting for. It's preparing you as a change that the nations of Africa is waiting for. Africa needs the help of the righteous man. You know in the book of Proverbs chapter 14 verse 34, the Bible declares that righteousness exalts a nation and sin is a reproach to any people. Will you want sin to reproach Africa? Will you want sin to reproach Nigeria? I know you don't want it. I know you want righteousness to exalt this nation. I know you want righteousness to lift us up and therefore come and join this change. Let us create standards that makes us fit into the global community. If Africa does not rise up to the standard of the global community, Africa cannot merge to the global community. We'll always need help from outside. We'll always need support from outside. It's time to deliver our quarter to the world. It's time for us to lead. It's time for us to stand out and be those people that God has made us to be. A unique people. To get more details of this special broadcast, request for the latest edition of our ministry publications, Teach All Nations, Time Project. This edition, Healing the Nation by the Word, teaches you on how you can effect changes in your nation, how a word from God can change your nation, and prophetic word from God to Nigeria and the nations of Africa. We also have other titles such as Kingdom Mentality, World Changers, Understanding and Utilizing the Power of God and much more. Get your copy now. Thank you for listening. 
We believe you have been empowered by the word minister to you to partner with us ministering God's love in a hurting world. Get our materials to build your faith and to contact us for prayer requests, testimony of salvation and miracles, you can write to us. World Salvation Center, P.O. Box 887, Satellite Delta State, Nigeria. Or you can visit our website www.dayofsalvation.org.ng or our email apostle at dayofsalvation.org or eoforade at gmail.com We have come to the end of today's broadcast. Do not miss our next broadcast. The heaven and earth shall pass away, but God's word abided forever. Jesus is Lord.